Getting close with other people can be intimidating. When should you say hello, excuse me, or get your head out of your uh, <clears throat> headset? How does the modern person get closer to other people in today's mess of headphones and headsets and drones and phones and tireless, wireless, cloud-based, booyah-based, super-duper, loop-de-looper, high-speed, download, overloaded, overstuffed, connected, unconnectedness? Surely this is better and different. Bonding experiences, like role-playing, are a great way to get closer with other people and enjoy using your imagination. But be careful, bonding can get spicy. I said be careful. Oh boy. Getting close with other people can be as easy as a friendly game of chess. It's an opportunity to become well-versed in moves like the Rook Cook, the Knight Slapper Dapper, the Pawn Popper, and the King Yanker. Oopsie daisy. Getting closer in a new town can be as simple as saying something nice. Like, imagine a rainbow to say hello. So you get a superhero polar bear in red spandex to say see you tomorrow. This guy again? Hey, no waving in the air with that whatchamit thingy on your face. Read the sign! Look at these ne'er-do-wells. But wait, nothing has been defaced, disfigured, or visually vandalized. What gives? This is certainly a new way to be close with Grandma. Oh, here comes the fuzz. Nothing to see here, officers. Our VR friend is still lost. Will he ever lay eyes on the real world? Getting close with other people can be intimidating. But as soon as you get your head out of your uh, <clears throat> astronomically large and astonishing headset, you can say hello to other people. There you have it, folks. All it takes to get closer to other people is other people. Help us build a world where being together is the main story.